Hey guys, this is gonna be a short one today and it's all about this little mic and why it's my absolute favorite right now for vlogging. So of course, this isn't the most high quality microphone. I mean, even the Rode Video Micro is gonna give you a better quality of sound. But honestly, oftentimes this microphone is just kind of a pain in the ass to bring around, especially when you're just vlogging or doing other things that are kind of in a non-professional environment. And especially with the A6400, this microphone on the hot shoe completely blocks the rear screen, making it pretty ineffective for having that vlogging screen there in the first place as well as when you're putting this camera away into a bag or something like that. Um, this microphone, you definitely don't wanna have it on top of the hot shoe, just in case it breaks off or damages your hot shoe in any way. And while there are some workarounds with hot shoe brackets that move the hot shoe to the side of the camera, it's still not the best solution, in my opinion, of having this huge microphone dangling from the side of your camera. Um, for just everyday kind of vlogging purposes. But as I'm sure you all know, as soon as you take this microphone off your camera and try to vlog using just the built-in mics, you know, that may work for your indoor settings, but as soon as you go outdoors, it's kind of a complete nightmare. There's really nothing like wind noise to absolutely ruin a clip, especially if you're trying to capture audio. So I started looking around for a solution and found this little guy on Amazon. This is the Ceramonic SR-XM1 microphone and it's basically made to plug into a GoPro to give the GoPro better audio but I found that I can plug this into the A6400 and get some pretty useful benefits over the built-in mics on the A6400. Especially if you pair it with a windscreen such as this, which was made for a, a different type of microphone, so it doesn't come with this microphone. It just fits the Ceramonic really well and reduces the wind noise that would plague the built-in microphones on any camera. It definitely won't muffle the wind as much as this kind of dead cat would, which comes with a video micro, but honestly, for the size and price of this windscreen, it does a pretty decent job. Quick trip to the park. Ah, uh, yeah. Way, go away. Come again another day. <laughs> way, way, way. Go away. Bye, bye. That's grandma over there. But of course, there are some drawbacks to using a microphone this small. As you can see, it just plugs directly into the auxiliary port on the camera, making it really easy to just kind of plug in and use. You don't have to worry about blocking the screen or using up your hot shoe mount or anything like that. Just plugs directly in and it's really nice and small just on the side of the camera here. But as you can also see, it doesn't really have any shock absorber mount on the microphone. So any vibrations on the camera gets transmitted right through to the microphone and gets captured into your audio clip. But as I said, overall, I think this is a great solution for anyone that wants to vlog with a small camera It doesn't want to fit a big microphone onto their camera, making it really conspicuous and just being a big burden to carry around. So if you're looking to pick one up, please feel free to use the links down below. It really helps out the channel, giving us a small commission on your purchase with absolutely no additional cost to you. So we really appreciate it. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.